Hi friends, welcome to Testing Tutorials Point. This is Lokesh Gorantra and today we are going to discussing about mobile automation testing by using Python. Hi friends, welcome back with a new session and here uh, today we are going to discussing about how to record a script by using App Image Inspector. Okay. In my previous video, you can able to see that context and all how we can able to do it and all these are right. Now just I'm going to run for this one to failing for that particular one. Okay and then it will come up with the one location and it will stop and then we'll start for recording session okay i'll show you the clear cut how that uh, easiest way to record in case if you don't know how to take the path and you don't know how to take the element values okay now here it will fail right now no need to worry about it and here will be fail okay and then we need to come to here and we know already for desired capability how we need to provide and all right and how we can able to communicate with that particular uh, emulator now i'm going to here starting my session before starting we need to run for our rpm inspector okay rpm server then we can able to do it okay then i'm going to start for my session okay once i start the session i will get it for this particular window okay now i will get for my window okay you can see here there is a start symbol there is a i i symbol will be there starting recording okay starting record there is a i symbol okay in maybe in your uh, system maybe it is change the location you need to uh, mouse over into the any element you can able to get for start recording okay you once click the start recording it will start for here then you need to click for what all the things you want now you can see here allow location is there then you can come to this top okay tap if you tap this one it will allow you for uh, accepting okay then we need to click for this particular one you need to click one time and you need to tab one time then it will open for you can able to see create new contact even it is recording for uh, accessibility id and create contact okay then okay Oh, sometimes it will happen. Now this is the one happening, but okay. Now you can see here. Now this is a first name. Okay, first name location I provided. Now you need to. There is a text box before uh, after tab. There is a text box here. You need to pass it for name. What name you want? And then there is a send case. If you click the send case, you can able to see here the name also display name here okay if you come there is it will take for send keys as well and if you go for phone number and comes to in this location provide for any number okay and click for send keys now it will take it then you need to click for save button and you need to click this one okay once you click it will save the code now sometimes it will uh, not able to save this particular button because it's a toolbar right sometimes it will happen but you need to uh, the id it is not able to tap it okay sometimes it will happen like this then we need to one by one we need to scroll then only we can able to identify okay uh, but the save button we know already that we can able to take in the later okay then we need to stop this pass one and here you can able to choose for any programming language which programming language you want to take the script it will give you four primes and wdio scripting oxygen and j unit python ruby robot framework all the things we can able to copy your code okay you can see there is a third one clipboard you can copy 
and comes to your notepad and paste it and choose and this is a lengthy x path now based upon our convenient we can change for this x path okay no need to take this much x path we can able to modify and this one as well okay and the last one we can able to click for save button this is a toolbar button but it will not work properly then we need to change the x path then we can able to use it and we can run then it will click for all the things okay how we are going to do for automation similar format you can able to do it the same path it will work for you as well before that i'll uh, here i'll create one file right click new python record script okay record script and then i'm going to use it for this one before that we can able to new contacts one only because our code is new contacts one only right you can minimize and go to here copy everything and come back here okay now i'll change for my xpath for first name okay this is my first name one and i can able to give you for phone number as well similar format phone number okay then save button this is my save button okay remaining everything see just i'm going to uh deleting this code okay now we'll see run we'll run and see whether we can able to do it or not okay and here the first name location i'm going to use for location and i'm going to run my script and we can able to see here which is the one we recorded and we took right the same script only first name and last name and everything we are going to see the contacts are opening allowed and it is clicking for new and it is going to enter location and provide the number and the save button we need to click save button for the save button location it is taking some problem okay but the way we uh, everything it is same oh sorry we need to change the x path actually here i need to change the x path then only it will take for right here x path okay if you write the x path then only it will take it because uh, it is saying the id right but as per the id it will not work for that that's why it is waiting for the element okay but what we written everything is perfect means what we recorded by using appm inspector okay even you can uh, if you don't know how to take the x path and how to take the element and all you can able to use this is the process record the session and uh, take the script and use it into your local it will work for you as well okay this is a small session okay thank you for watching thank you for watching please do subscribe and share to your friends and colleagues and don't forget to comment on this video thank you